Meantime, a juvenile is in state custody facing charges related to yesterday's school threat in Preston County. The Sheriff's Department made that announcement last night after the threat led to an early dismissal at Preston High School. Today, 12 News talked with Preston County Prosecutor James Shea. It's not clear if the juvenile will face adult charges, but typically a hearing would be held for a juvenile within 10 days. What we're looking at is, is, is making a terroristic threat, at least initially. You know how you know, prosecution, sometimes you, you end up changing the charge or adding charges or whatever. I don't know what that will look like down the road, but at this point, that's, that's what we're looking at. And in the grand scheme of things, particularly for a juvenile, I think you know, anytime you have a juvenile charged with what would be a felony when they're adult, you're looking at the more serious of it, end of things. In West Virginia, a felony charge of making a terroristic threat carries a sentence of one to three years as well as fines. All Preston County schools were on a remote learning schedule today. Tonight's football game between the Preston High School Knights and uh, Fairmont Senior is still scheduled to take place in Kingwood.